everyone and welcome to today's lesson about articulation on the trombone. I am your instructor for the day, Sean Bell, and we are going to talk about how we start notes on this instrument today. All right, to get our notes started, what we want to use is our tongue and our air. Our air does most of the work, but our tongue does do a little bit just to help us start that note. So what you're going to want to think about is your tongue is going to touch through your mouth and then it's going to release that airway. It works like a little valve, closing and opening. So feel with your tongue from your teeth back, you will feel a small ridge that feels hard just a little bit behind your teeth. Do that for me. That is where we want our tongue to target. Now, what I want you to do is take a breath in and touch the tongue to the roof of your mouth as you're blowing out. You'll momentarily stop the air and then when you release the tongue, the air moves again and you'll probably feel just a little bit of pressure build up inside of your oral cavity. Try that for me one more time. Take a breath in, blow, stop the air by touching the roof of your mouth with your tongue, and then release it. Now that entire time, I want you to keep your air kind of in the on position. It does not stop. The tongue regulates whether that air is moving through your lips or whether it's not. Um, the syllable we probably want to think about connecting with is the word to. T-O or maybe the word do, D-O. If we say to or do, we can feel how the tongue touches the roof of their mouth, just like we did when we were blowing our air, and then it releases. That is kind of our default setting as brass players. That's going to give us a nice clear attack on the beginning of each note. All right, let's put some of this into practice on our instrument. Um, very quick, we're going to review our first five notes that we learned in the last lesson. This is a concert F. E flat, D, C, and B flat. I'll throw some of this on the screen. Remember, your positions here are first for F, third for E flat, fourth for D, sixth for C, and first for B flat. Here we go, we're gonna give it a try. These are all gonna be whole notes. One, two, three. There are our first five notes that we learned. Now we're going to break those notes into four quarter notes each. We're also going to add a count uh, or a measure, excuse me, of rest in between each new position. Just so you have time to make sure you're in the right position and think about your tonguing. So we're going to sing, or excuse me, we're going to play two, 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 or more precisely, if we just move our air. Remember, our air is always on. The tongue is regulating the starting of each one of these notes. So let's check it out um, with four quarter notes on each one of those notes. One, two, three. Rest, two, three. Rest, two, three. Rest, two, three. Rest, two, three. Okay, cool. So that is the basics of how we articulate on the trombone. There are many different types of articulations that are going to give us slightly different sounds of attacks. And we'll talk about those in future lessons. But remember, for today, we want to think our air is always in the on position. Our tongue regulates that air by saying the syllable to or do, where we touch the roof of the mouth and then release that air to start the note. 